Greetings from Washington, D.C. and happy 100th anniversary to the National Cherry Blossom Festival. Hey everybody, it's Ryan. I'm here in Southwest D.C. alongside of the Potomac River. We're exactly 100 years to the day U.S. Presidential First Lady Michelle Obama did a reenactment planting of this cherry blossom tree. Now the original cherry blossom trees planted on March 27th of 1912 were planted alongside of the Tidal Basin area. This tree was planted alongside of the Potomac River, which is still part of the festival. There are over 2,000 trees throughout the District of Columbia which make up the National Cherry Blossom Festival. But how can you find this exact tree? Well, the best way to do it is to look at a photograph from the day when Michelle planted the tree. You can see there she is with the shovel. Now what's interesting is the three branches on the tree that stand behind the tree planted by Michelle Obama. You can see that in this way you can match it up. It's these branches right here. Now here's a panoramic area view of this location. What we're seeing in that walkway back there is uh, West Basin Drive and Ohio Drive Southwest. Now when you're actually standing at the tree, you can see behind the brand new Martin Luther King Jr. Memorial, which is unveiled for the first time this year during the National Cherry Blossom Festival. There was an attempt to do the dedication on the day of the I Had a Dream speech anniversary, but due to a hurricane, it had to be pushed back. Here is the Washington Monument, and we're sort of close to the Lincoln Memorial area if you are in fact looking for this tree. Now when is this tree in bloom? Well average peak bloom is April 4th. Now we planted this tree on March 27th and it was in bloom one week prior. That does not mean though that there are not any blossoms on the tree. Here we are celebrating the 100th anniversary of the National Cherry Blossom Festival with blossoms on the tree planted by Michelle Obama. Happy anniversary to this wonderful festival.